Kamar de los Reyes, a television, movie and voice actor best known for playing a gang member turned cop in the soap, One Life to Live, and a villain in the video game, Call of Duty. Black Ops E has died in Los Angeles at 56, the family announced. De Los Reyes died Sunday following a brief battle with cancer, according to a statement from Lisa Goldberg, a publicist for De Los Reyes' wife, Sherry Song. In One Life to Live, De Los Reyes starred as Antonio Vega, a former gang member who became a lawyer and then a cop, alongside Song. In the popular video game, Call of Duty, Black Ops E, he played the villain Raul Menendez. He also had roles in Fox's Sleepy Hollow, ABC's The Rookie and Seagull's All-American. The family statement said that at the time of his death, De Los Reyes was filming All-American and had recently shot roles in Marvel's upcoming Daredevil series and Hulu's yet-to-be-released Washington Black, starring Sterling K. Brown. De Los Reyes was born in Puerto Rico and raised in Las Vegas. According to a biography provided by the family, he caught the bug for acting when he arrived in Los Angeles in the late 80s. Early roles include playing Pedro Quinn in the 1994 off-Broadway play, Blade to the Heat, and Ferdinand in director George C. Wolfe's production of The Tempest for Shakespeare in the Park. On the big screen, De Los Reyes appeared in Oliver Stone's Nixon, playing Watergate burglar Eugenio Martinez as a Secret Service agent in Salt with Angelina Jolie and in The Cell with Jennifer Lopez. De Los Reyes lived in Los Angeles, however, his heart never left Puerto Rico, the family statement said, adding that the actor had been active in the recovery efforts after Hurricane Maria in 2017. The actor is survived by wife Sam and three sons, Kaylin, 26, and twins Michael and John, age 9. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more stories like this. Thank you for watching and see you next time.